As complaints by the public about poor road and shoddy construction works by road contractors have caught the attention of the Auditor General. For this reason, an audit of all road networks in the country is underway in Accra with the Tetequashi Legon Medina Road beginning the exercise. This is the first time such an assessment of the country's roads is being conducted by the audit service. Supported by engineers and other experts, they are evaluating the quality of work and whether the contractors met all specifications and requirements. Portions of the asphalt road is drilled after which the sample will be tested in the lab. Vitamin content, length, width and breadth of both the road and ancillary functions will also be assessed. The length of the first sample drilled at Shashi opposite the Ghana Standards Authority was 107 millimeters, while that of Oponglo Junction was 125. The third was taken at Legong, which was 97. Another from the Legon Presec was 130, and the last at Atomic Junction was 85 millimeters. This is the, the quality aspect that you see. We've taken a call, some aspect of the road call. It's a cylinder, 100 millimeters in diameter. And what we want to do is, the first test we did was to measure, to see the thickness. And you saw that it was 125 millimeters. We don't know whether that was what the contract said. But we'll be in our offices and the information that we'll get, we'll compare with the contract and see whether it was 125 or it was more or it was less than we determined. Apart from that, we're going to test for the aggregates, the stone that they use. We'll test for the bitumen content, we'll test for the density, we'll test for the air voids, then, and of course, as I tell the thickness. In totality, these are the basic things that the, the specifications have been given to the contractor. When we do that, we're just giving assurance to government that Ghana Highways Authority is doing what they are supposed to do. The Auditor General, Mr. Daniel Domilevo, cautioned contractors executing ongoing government projects not to shortchange government. Under my mandate under Article 187, if government suffers any loss or deficiency, whoever is responsible for that, I'm supposed to disallow and say charge the person. So this, at the end of this exercise is for them to estimate how much government has lost. If government has lost any money, then we are going to disallow and search out the contractor and the one who supervised the job. If you collect money to construct a two-kilometer road, make sure you have made the two-kilometer exactly. Don't do 1.8 and we pay you for it. The assessment is to be conducted in phases. The western, eastern, volta and upper east regions will all be captured in the first phase.